Welcome back. I'm HD Cody with the Modfather Gaming Channel. We're going to continue Monster Hunter World. Uh, last time we left off, I told you I was going to run around, uh, farm some materials, try to upgrade my armor, grab some new armor, and uh, I got some I got some better gear. Um, I've been messing around with the bow and the the large katana, and uh, I like those a lot. But uh, our next objective is to speak to the commander, so let's uh, talk to him. You've done well. Uh, nice work clearing out the camp. I knew you'd come through, and now we're uh, we're finally ready. All right, Hunter, the, the Pukai Pukai hunt is on. Once you've hunted the target, the scholars will be able to get a closer look at the evidence you found. I cannot stress enough how vital taking out the Pukai Pukai is for the commission. This could be the break we've been waiting for. Good luck done. and be careful. The fifth has an urgent mission. Partner, you'd better come see me. All righty. Let's go up and talk to our uh, handler. Looks like we're going our separate ways. Good luck, and I didn't get to read it all. Let's go to the canteen. We need to switch out our weapons before we uh, move out. Hey there, partner. Hello. All right, partner. Time for us to do a little pukai pukai hunting. Once we've done that, the scholars can go in and check the check out the slag. Check out that slag. See if it came from Zora Magdaros. But seriously, what other monster could it have come from? I mean, I'm no scholar, but smoldering lava rock. Hello. So, uh, what do we have to do next? Um, here it is, the Pukai hunt. So we'll start it. And, uh, we'll see if we can't find some people to join us. I, uh, ran around a lot on my own. Because I was really confused about the game. I had no clue what I was doing. And, uh, I learned a lot. Well, I want to say I learned a lot. But um, when they look for people to join you, um, it's like in the immediate area. So uh, it could, I guess it's like all the people that are in my uh, session right now. So if they didn't want to join me, they don't really have to. Is this the one I was using? Or is this the one I was using? I think it was this one. Yeah, this sword's really good. All right, so we have enough people. So what we'll do is we'll depart and then once we get there, we'll send out an SOS flare, and hopefully somebody will respond and help us out. So, let's, uh, let's head out. Alright. Time limit, 50 minutes. Alright, so. Let's, uh... Fire SOS flare. Let's see. Let's see if anybody joins us to help us. If not, um, we're doing this alone. See, I, uh, I found out that the difficulty changes when you're uh, offline, it gets reduced. And um, when you're online, it increases. And not 100% clear, it wasn't very clear on whether or not it increases if you're online by yourself or if you're online with other people. But if it increases while you're online by yourself, then that's, uh, that sucks. This thing might take a while. Uh, there's the Pukai we spotted earlier. Watch out when its head and tail are swollen. All right, let's get our asses kicked. Um, I'm stunned because he growled. We're gonna get our asses kicked. Oh! Help me, George. Yeah, this sword's really, really good. I was complaining a lot with the other sword because it was it was huge and it, it took forever to swing. But this one's huge, but it doesn't take anywhere near as long to swing. So, I mean, that sword would be pretty ideal if you're using it to fight, like, uh, big, slow enemies. Then it would make sense to use it. But when you're using it, against really fast enemies like I was last time, then it's going to whoop your ass, which it did for a very, very long time. All right. Sharpened our sword up. Not sure what I'm looking at. This thing's ugly. See, when I hit its tail, that, that line pops up on the screen like I'm doing something right. I didn't that time, though. 
Or that time. Ooh, it kicked me. Ooh, somebody joined my quest. Buku Maru joined my quest. Is that an NPC or is that a real person? Well, this guy's got poison. It's like a snake bird thing. See, look, quest difficulty has been adjusted for multiplayer. So, so maybe it doesn't increase if I'm online and alone then. Maybe it's just when somebody's joining me then. Which is uh, good to know. Oh shit, that's poison stuff, isn't it? Can I poison him? He does poison. Oh no, somebody left the online session. Oh wait, that's not the quest, never mind. Come on guys, where you at? Jeez! Just throwing up all over the damn place. Chopped his tail off. Oh, damn! Uh, everybody's stunning me. I can't move. He stunned me again. I'm stunned three times now. This is fair. Oh, come on. I want this tail. Harvest it. Harvest it! Oh, no! What? Oh, that's not right. <laughs> that's not right. I got the tail, though. Hey, what's up? Here's a person. Hey, man, what's up? He's walking all slow and cool like. I guess he's not going to wave or anything. He's too cool. All right, let's go find this thing. Finish him off. Is he going to be, like, weaker now that we took his tail off? That would be awesome. Yeah, I've learned a lot playing. I played a lot um, Expedition, like Free Roam, in my own time. And uh, I learned quite a bit about the game. A lot of things that I was uh, confused about. That big dinosaur thing um, that just one-shotted me. Me and uh, three other people fought it and... Uh, after a very, very, very long time, a few hours, we finally uh, took it down. But uh, yeah, he one-shot at us. I couldn't even tell you how many times. Should have recorded it. I have some of his materials that you get from killing him, but I don't have enough to make anything with it. Yeah, see, once you once you use this sword, like the regular triangle attack, you'll like build up that red meter, and then um, once you have the red meter filled up you can use the R2 attack and he does like a bunch of damage to him. It's really nice. The sword's really good. I want to craft some better armor. For a second there I thought he had his tail back. Where's my uh, teammates? Where's my Palico at, too? By the way. I'll just chop this foot up, I guess. <laughs> What's he doing? Yeah, it says there's three people with me, but I don't know where they're at. Do they know that they joined me to fight this thing? <laughs> I need some help. I'm actually doing pretty decent on my own. I'm not doing bad. Small monster killing. Are they killing things for me? Somebody's completing a bounty for me. What sucks is you can't pause this game. Let's see if I can sharpen my sword. Is he going to let me? Uh-oh. Uh. Alright, so I got to sharpen it. What's he doing? Oh, he's flying away. Um, that's actually good, because then I can take a, uh, potion. 
I don't have a regular potion, apparently. Uh, will, will rations increase my health? Nope, that's stamina. Alright, we'll put my stamina back up. I guess I'll take a mega potion. It's kind of a waste, but I'm going to take it anyway. Um, let's open up our map and see where the hell my teammates are. So here's the dude we're chasing. Um, well, here's two of my teammates right here. And then there's one teammate right here. Alright, see, now that I have enough stuff to track him. Yeah, see, there was a tutorial on this, but I w it wasn't very clear. Or I was reading it and just not making sense of it, because, uh, let's face it, there is a lot of reading and a lot of tutorials, and it can be a little bit overwhelming. I'm assuming it'll be more overwhelming if you're new to the series like I am, or maybe I just wasn't um, actually reading it. <laughs> and uh, Basically, once you track him enough, he'll show up on the map, and then you can pin him on the map and then you can uh you'll have his location okay so here's my here's a couple of my friends now showed up to help which is good oh damn he's on his back <laughs> yeah these monsters like these big monsters in this game they have a lot of health a lot of health Oh good. He's on the ground, he's stunned, let's get him. Oh, the Jaggers is over here attacking us too. We are going ham on this guy. And he's still not dead. Alright, let me uh... Oh, is he gonna let me go? Let me sharpen this real quick. My sword's getting dull! Oh, you bitched. <laughs> what a bitch move. <laughs> Let me sharpen it. I need some health, but I don't want to keep wasting my mega potions. Damn. This is going to be a while. Flying away? Oh yeah, he's on the he's on the run. Or maybe is he? I don't know. Ooh, bone pile. Let's grab. Let's harvest this Jagras. Um, I could really use some health. I could have swore that I had that mushroom stuff. Um, or no, it's like healing herb something. I don't know where it is. We'll have to look for it some other time. Alright, let's go chase this dude down again. And uh, hopefully finish him off. He's got a lot of health. Alright, so is this his nest? Or is he just hanging out up here? Oh, somebody's already here fighting him. <laughs> Alright, people, let's finish him. Damn. Damn. A lot of damage. Oh my gosh. Let's really see what the hell's going on. We're fighting him in a little tiny area. Oh, we broke something off of him. We broke him. How is he still alive? Are all the monsters in this game this strong? I hope not. Would you stop swinging in that direction? I'm holding forward. <laughs> oh, he's gonna run again, seriously? Stop running. Little bitch boy. Must have staggered him. Oh, he's dead, nice. Nice. Let's uh, go into the chat thing. If it'll let me chat and um, shout outs thanks all right let's harvest this thing up I said thanks so let's harvest this thing up don't want to leave anything behind 
We're getting Pukai Pukai sacks. I don't know what those are. Um, gestures. Wave. Let's wave to him. <laughs> He's doing a gesture too. Well, she's. Is it a girl? I don't know. Somebody said awesome, happy times. Thanks. Thank you. I'm inside of the Puka Puka. Where the hell is George at, by the way? Ditched me. Okay. So, uh, we got a whole bunch of good stuff, it looks like. Bones, ancient bones. Pukai Pukai stuff. Hunter rank went up to three. Palico level went up, even though he wasn't here doing anything. All right. Nice. Let's uh, let's head on out. Done well. All right. Excellent work putting down that Pukai Pukai. I knew I put the task in the right hands. Just to catch you up, we're hot on the trail of Azor of Zora Magdaros now. Listen up. But there's more to figure out. I need the fifth to protect our scholars while they investigate. I'm putting you in charge of the Wild Wildspire Waste. The quest will begin once you've convened on site. Right, Wildspire Waste. To begin the Elder Dragon investigation. Make sure you know what, sure you, you, need know what you need to do. Um, is that a new area? So now we need to protect the scholars. Let's regroup at the Wildspire Waste. I'm gonna assume that it's a new place that we unlock, maybe. But uh, yeah, since uh, we last played. I've uh, learned uh, that this is where you can buy supplies right here at this little guy's place, and then this is where you like get bounties and stuff. We'll skip this because he says the same thing every time almost. So here's the bounty we handed in. We got 100 research points and an armor sphere, 100 research and two armor spheres. Uh, let's uh, hey, let's let's just grab some random bounties just so we have something on hand to earn. Otherwise, we're it's it's going to waste. Really, we're not making any progress towards our bounties. Um, let's run up to the smithy real quick before we, uh, start the next quest, and, um, see if we can't upgrade something real quick. Alright, um, hi dude, what's up? Yes, yes, uh, upgrade equipment. Can we upgrade our sword? So if we want to upgrade this, we need two earth crystal. Where do you get Earth Crystal at? Um, for this, I need a couple of things I don't even know what they are yet. Ooh! Oh, I need an I need Anjanath Fang and a Flame Sack to upgrade this to a Blazing Shotel. Wow. We might have to build that next. Um, upgrade equipment. Let's look at our armor. You know, we could probably upgrade our armor. But uh, we're not going to do that yet. Let's see if we can forge new armor. Do we have anything new? Yeah, see, I have the Anja armor available now, but I don't have the resources to make it. All right, so I'm going to save my um, my armor spheres for when we uh, get the new better armor, because I feel like I already wasted enough armor spheres on my armor that I have now. And let's face it, you're going to change out armor um, throughout this game a, a bunch of times, and... Uh, you don't want to waste all your armor spheres on low-level armor. Um, let's do the next quest. Uh, assigned... Is this it? Uh, the best kind of quest. Is that it? Wild Spire Waste. I'm going to assume that this is it, because this is Wild Spire Waste, which is where we got to go next. So Let's load this thing up. Quest accepted. Um, and then once this thing's ready, we'll just take off and we'll shoot an SOS flare and hope that somebody joins us. Uh, before we go, before we depart, while it's loading the quest up, we're going to head up to the canteen. I've called it the cantina in previous episodes. I could have swore that's what they said. Um, and we're going to... We're going to get something to eat that's going to boost our stats. Uh, attack up. Is this just attack? Unpredictable platter. Let's buy this. We'll skip this. Should we skip this? Hey, let's skip this. They're just gonna cook it. Uh, the f feline deflector. Okay, so we got our attack up. Let's depart, and we'll uh, have people join us on the way. Or once we get there. 
Well, this place looks cool. This looks like a place in uh, Dragon's Age Inquisition, that desert place. I can't remember the name of it. Except this one looks much nicer. Why are you pushing it? I thought there was something towing it. We've waited this long to get our hands on the evidence we need. Don't get us killed now, Hunter. I hardly slept oh, shit. last night. Let's uh so excited to go out and see this new piece of evidence. Oh, it, it's the not available till after the cutscene. The desert area of the wildfire. Guide us there safely, partner. Okay. I'll try my best. I've never been here, so don't I don't know what to expect. But I do want to collect all these new herbs. Fire herb, nice. Oh no. One thing's for sure. The environment here is completely different from the ancient forest. Yes. The wildfire waste features a mixture of dry land and swamps, which naturally supports its own unique ecosystem. I don't know what the fire herb's for, but I want to collect it since it's new. Oh, this is regular herb. I'm maxed out, so why am I not maxed out on uh potions then? That's strange. I'm gonna have to figure out how hey, to craft look, him. A the water filters down through the sand and collects in the lower areas, thus creating a mire. Oh great. We get to go uphill now. Should I be helping push? Come on now, my dear handler. <laughs> back in it. I can't help. Can I get in it? <laughs> Defend the researchers. I'm not I don't have to defend them from anything yet. Let's see if I can uh, craft a... What's it called? A potion? Why can't I craft a potion? Look at that insect. Is that some type of beetle? The wildlife here are quite resilient creatures. <laughs> they have adapted excellently to the dry climate. Even the plants have learned to survive. The fruit scattered throughout the area has a hard shell that helps retain moisture. I should have put this stuff into my item box, because now I'm going to have to get rid of random stuff that I, uh, I don't have room for now. Maybe we'll get an item box once we get up there. Hopefully. We should be setting up a campsite once we get up there. There's campsites in the first place, so I don't see why we wouldn't have one here. Let's go! You guys are taking way too long. Oh, dear me. We made it. Can we have a break now? Look, the wildfire. That's where we'll find what we came for. Okay. But we still have a ways to go. Yeah, we well, do. On we go. We have a long ways to go. Holy crap. Actually. Downhill might be worse. This is so oh no. Heavy. Why am I? Wa I can't walk any faster than this. <clears throat> I don't understand. The wagon's empty, so why did they need to bring it? Isn't it? Isn't it empty? Yeah, it's empty. There's nothing in it. There's a barrel with a shovel on the side and a pickaxe, and then some bags. I don't know what the hell they are. Whoa, what's that? Did, did you hear that? Everyone, be careful. Mind checking it out for us there, partner? Uh on second thought. Why am I getting twelve points for the collecting hard fruit? No, dear me. Oh no. I don't have to fight that, do I? Tell me I don't have to fight that. Oh no. Stay calm, stay calm. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. Just move on through. You might be able to use your slinger to create some kind of noise and distract her. Now, run! <laughs> as long as we don't have to fight it, I'm okay with that. I do not want to fight that thing. 
I don't think I'll be able to. Go, go, go! Run for your life! Oh, man. Well, at least we don't have to fight it. That's a good thing. Where the hell is this campsite? Uh, Slashberry. Is that new, too? I don't know. I guess not. Oh, we're hauling ass with this wagon now. So is the campsite going to be where that spire is? That was horrifyingly close. I'd say. Hell hath no fury like a Rathian scorn. Well, like any Rathian, actually. But she could provide the commission with valuable data. Hunter, I couldn't trouble Oops, you. Oops, I didn't mean it. Could I? Oh, look at that. You can There's a quick There's a quick communication wheel. I didn't know that. That's cool. Get out of here, bird. Um. I was aware that Zora Bagros was an enormous beast, but I am in shock over how gargantuan it really is. Yes, it certainly seems to exceed the measurements in all the guild's writings. I wonder. How many years does it take for a beast like this to grow to such an enormous size? I don't know how to craft a damn potion. I don't get it. <laughs> oh look, Aceros. An herbivore native to this region. Wait. Well, why are they running? They're not running, they're they look scared. They're just hanging out, kinda. See? When Apseros feel threatened, they assume a defensive posture. Whatever's out there, it could be a danger to us, too. We have to be careful. Yeah, we do. Finally. I thought we'd never get here. Yeah, me either. Look at it. Glorious. It is absolutely massive. What a magnificent specimen. Yeah, it is pretty damn big. Oh, look at this footprint. We're almost there. Keep it up. That's huge. I hope there's new cool stuff here. Job, I haven't done anything. Oh no, what are those? Investigation added. Let's see what kind of present Zora Magdaros has left for us. Are those things friendly? Quicksand patch? That? Do I sink in it? Doesn't look like it. Um, I guess I have to walk up here by myself? Oh, okay. fight something like that oh good what is that I can now use an SOS flare. Okay, let's use it. Where the hell is it? Fire the damn thing. Oh! Alright, it's not as big as I thought it was. But it's still pretty damn big. Oh, it got me. Damn, this thing's huge. Oh, I broke something. 
I don't know what I broke. Somebody help me. Oh! I was in the middle of a combo. I couldn't cancel it and move. Yeah, distract him, George. I have a feeling that I don't want to hit him on the head. I'm just thinking the back legs or his tail or something. Tail. Oh, there we go. I'm getting something off his tail. I don't know what that goo is on the ground. Yeah, see the head? My, my sword bounced off of his head. Ooh, 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 I broke something else. Did I break his back leg? So his back leg and his tail seem to be weak or something. Or not that leg. I need to get my whetstone ready. Because I need to sharpen this thing up soon. I might as well do it now. He's not looking at me. There we go. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I broke something else. What am I breaking? What the fuck's he doing? <laughs> Ooh. Watch out for that tail. I wonder what kind of armor I can craft from harvesting materials from this thing. I bet you it's some big ass, heavy, sweet looking armor. Maybe some good defense armor. Ooh, yeah. Ah. I don't know why he's fighting me with his tail. He's not turning around or anything. Oh, well, there we go. I asked for it. Hey, uh, what about my SOS flare, guys? Anybody gonna help me? Oh, I broke something else. Oh, I broke his tail off. Stop. What are you running for? I want to harvest it. And get punched. I don't want it to disappear and not get it. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, George, distract him, George. Very nice. Bareth shell. Yeah! Woo! Ugh! I wonder if I can do something with his back legs now that I, I cut his tail off. Ah. I'm not losing health that badly, really. Um, what are you going? What are you doing? Ooh, somebody joined the quest. Help me. Help me, Tom Cruise. Alright, we might as well sharpen this thing up. He's not... It's not like we're, he's gonna get out of our sight. Alright. <clears throat> so. What, uh, one thing I noticed is when I upgraded my sword, um, I got, like, an extra duration, or, like, an extra durability bar before I have to fix it up so it stays sharp for a little longer so that's pretty cool every time you upgrade it it stays uh it doesn't go as dull as fast so that's cool that was one of my uh complaints was your weapon goes dull way too fast oh thanks buddy i was just about to use a potion you can't hit me with oh well he hit me anyway i was gonna say you can't hit me with your tail anymore but he figured out a way <laughs> I hope there's some armor that increases like mobility because it's hard to get around. Because they all they all the monsters move way faster than you. Let's chop this damn leg up. I'm stuck. I'm underneath of him. Oh, there we go. I'm out. I was scared for a minute. I'm not there anymore, bitch. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting some damage on his leg. Ooh. Where's that dude to join me? He's at the... He's at the bar. Relaxing. Oh, I was trying to dodge, but I was in the middle of a combo. Um, look out. And that's another thing. Whenever they growl, they, like, stun you and you can't move. It's really annoying. He's got one of those bigger wasps again to replenish my health. 
Coming, George. There we go, nice. Ah. Don't shake your ass at me, boy. I'm not into you. Yeah, so where's that dude at? I thought he was gonna help me. Ah. Let's chase him down. I don't know. Oh, there he is. He's up there. About damn time. Appreciate the help, but geez, where were you? Make me work for it. <laughs> All right. I'm coming, I'm coming. What is, what is this? Is this a Jagras? Um, where did he go? Is that him? Yeah, that's him. Ah. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> Let's roll all the way over there so we can hit him. And then miss. I can't even hit the damn thing. <laughs> there we go. Chop his toes up. Oh, nice, he stunned him. He used that plant thing to stun him. Let's break his damn leg. Yeah, even if you get one person to help you with each quest, it'll make it a lot easier. Just because... The monster might not even be difficult, but they have a ton of health, and it takes forever to kill them. It really does. Even like the the weak ones take forever to die sometimes. Oh, he broke something again. Doesn't seem to matter though. Now watch, I'm sharpening this, so he's gonna come after me. Can't even see the damn screen. <laughs> Light him up. Now he growled and we're stunned now. Ooh. What did I break? I broke something important. He did not like that. I'm trying to evade, but he's like raping me or something. <laughs> what the hell's he doing? Damn, these things have a lot of health. Oh, he's limping. Where are you going, little boy? I'll be right with you. I need to sharpen up. Oh, yeah. Let's chase this little boy down. Hey, look, he's in a little raft. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Shit. I wish there was no... I wish you would add infinite stamina. Oh, whoa! What happened? I thought he was running away. I would have been really pissed. Um, I'm stunned because he growled, which makes total sense. Oh, we broke something else again. Can't see. Oh, we broke something else. Holy shit. We're breaking all kinds of shit. Yeah. How is he still alive? Oh, we broke something else. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Don't roll towards him. Oh no. Yeah, he's targeting me because I have low health, I have a feeling. Oh good, that guy got him for me. Thank you. Okay, I see him, he's dead. Can I uh, move? <laughs> what are you doing? I wanna get over here and harvest this shit before the mission ends. 
Hell yeah, thank you for the help. Thank you very much. Uh, Bareth Scalp. Nice. Hopefully I can use this to, uh... Um, make a new armor. Okay, um... Let me... Go over here, shoutouts. Uh, thanks. And then, um... We'll do a gesture. We will wave to him. Thank you for the help, man. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's not gonna wave back. <laughs> He's just gonna stare awkwardly at me while I wave to him. Her? That's a girl. <sighs> yeah, even one person was a big help. Oh, hey. Glad you're back. Oh, don't worry. I found a safe place for the scholars to hide. Did you now? I guess I'll go round them up. Yeah, why don't you go do that? Back at camp. Oh, cool, we have a camp now. Yeah, I'm gonna have a lot of fun exploring this place off camera. This place is awesome. Who the hell are you? You there. Are you part of the fifth fleet? Looks like Orlando Bloom. The crossing is upon us again. <laughs> the years fly by faster. Then I can count them. Well, not now, he doesn't. I too am a hunter. Of the first fleet. Might I trouble you to share your tale with me? Let's find a suitable place. Whoa, is this a date? So, my old friends are well. Praise be. It sounds like the good scholars are as incorrigible as ever. Might I ask, are you tracking the monster that dropped that massive slag? I as well. It seems so easy. Follow the trail, find the truth. Why did they give him that hairstyle? <laughs> He looks absurd with it. He just doesn't just well, doesn't fit him well. It's been a pleasure. Nearby you will find my camp. I trust it will be of some avail to you and the others. Please pass a message on to the commander that I am safe. But a force compels me on and I intend to see where it takes me. If you too feel so compelled, then we will cross paths again at the end of all of this. Alrighty, weirdo. See you later. Was that who I think it was? I don't know. Who do you think it was? I can't read your mind. All right, so it's just under 18 minutes. Let's take all this stuff with us that we earned. I'm not even going to bother reading it all because it's going to take forever. Let's just say they're crafting materials. All right, we researched Zora Magdaros some more. Uh, we researched two out of three, the Bareth. Nice. Uh, target destroyer. I broke 11 parts. I told you I was breaking stuff left and right. We even chopped his tail off for good measure. <laughs> Good to see you. Fine work out there. Thanks to you. Our people are safe, and we know more about the target than ever. Since you left, we've been charting all the evidence we've collected across the continent. The scholars think they'll be able to pinpoint Zara, Zora Magdaros' location soon. Until then... Okay. Seems like a, a scholar has gotten separated from his escort. I need the fifth to go find him and guarantee his safety. The scholar was separated from his escort while collecting evidence in the Wildspire Waste. A new camp is available. All right, we have a camp in the Wildspire Waste. Nice. Um. All right. So before I end this one, let's uh, we'll uh, we'll walk over here and we'll hand in our uh, research points from the new monster, and then we'll walk up and see if I have anything new that I can craft. Maybe a new weapon. Who knows? I think I hand it into this guy. We'll just skip all this. Here we go. Look at that. Updated Pukai. Baroth, Zora Magdaros, and an Anjanath. Nice. 
Yeah, you have to talk to him in order to hand in your research points. So otherwise, it um, it doesn't go in. You don't hand in the points automatically. Um, off camera, I'm gonna figure out why the hell I don't have any damn potions. I don't understand that. Uh, let's go to the workshop. Let's have a look. See, I'm really excited. I want to craft something new, something better. Uh, forge equipment, armor. Oh yeah. Alloy. We can craft alloy armor now. All right, that might that might be cool. Uh, we can craft Bareth armor. Oh wow, that's ugly. That is some ugly shit. <laughs> Oh, but it's so much better, though. It's so much better than the alloy. We need Bareth... We need a Bareth tail. Why does it say I have to have a Bareth tail and I have zero? I thought I cut his tail off. Oh, and we need a Kestodon shell. So it looks like we're going to be fighting Kestodons. We're going to be looking for fertile mud. And uh, we need to fight some more Bareths. So in the meantime... Um... We can craft some... We can craft this, at least. I mean, I still need more Earth Crystal, though, it says. So I'll be able to craft, like, one of these things. Um... What should we craft? Let's craft this. F it. We'll skip this. We'll equip this. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can craft this, too. Um... Let's get the arms. All right, cool. Nice, nice. I'll look like a knight soon enough. All right, so the plan is to uh, figure out how the hell to craft potions because I don't understand why I'm not crafting potions. And then I'm gonna dump off all of my res all of my like uh, random stuff into this box that I'm not planning on using, so I can pick up all the new resources in the and the new place we unlocked. So when, uh, when we come back, hopefully I will figure out why I don't have any potions, and uh, we will be unburdened, and we will continue the next quest. So, this is Monster Hunter World. It's really good. Um, you just have to get to... You just have to get over the overwhelming learning curve, and you have to... Um, I mean, if you're new to the series, it's painful, but uh, once you start to understand some of the stuff, it's actually a lot of fun. Um, it's a great game, and uh, I would recommend playing it, at least trying it out. Um, I'm HD Cody with the Modfather Gaming Channel. This is Monster Hunter World. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and hopefully I will see you in the next one.